Jonathan Edwards, one of America's most influential theologians and thinkers, is the subject of George M. Marsden's biographical work, A Short Life of Jonathan Edwards. In this concise yet comprehensive book, Marsden delves into the life, ideas, and impact of this remarkable figure. Through his detailed research and engaging writing style, Marsden presents a nuanced portrait of Edwards, highlighting his intellectual prowess, his spiritual convictions, and his enduring legacy. Marsden begins by tracing Edwards' early life, painting a vivid picture of the colonial New England in which he was raised. Born into a family of Puritan ministers, Edwards grew up in an intellectually stimulating environment that fostered his deep religious convictions. Marsden explores Edwards' early education, his voracious appetite for reading, and the profound impact of his Puritan upbringing on his later theological work. The book then delves into Edwards' intellectual journey, particularly his theological and philosophical ideas. Marsden skillfully navigates through Edwards' writings, demonstrating his mastery of complex subjects such as metaphysics, morality, and the nature of God. Marsden emphasizes Edwards' unique synthesis of Calvinism and Enlightenment thought, positioning him as a bridge between traditional religious orthodoxy and the emerging rationalism of the era. Crucial to understanding Edwards is his famous sermon, Sinners in the Hands of an Angry God. Marsden delves into the historical context surrounding this powerful sermon, examining its reception and enduring significance. He elucidates Edwards' intent in delivering this fiery sermon, showing how it aimed to awaken sinners to the urgency of their need for salvation. Marsden also addresses the controversial aspects of Edwards' preaching style, exploring the tension between his fervent emotionalism and his deep intellectual rigor. Furthermore, Marsden explores Edwards' personal life, including his marriage to Sarah Pierpont. He sheds light on their deeply committed relationship, which proved essential in supporting Edwards' intellectual pursuits and ministerial duties. Marsden also delves into Edwards' involvement in the Great Awakening, a religious revival that swept through colonial America. By examining Edwards' sermons and his role in the revival, Marsden illustrates the profound impact he had on his contemporaries and subsequent generations. Throughout the book, Marsden skillfully navigates the complexities of Edwards' thought, presenting his ideas with clarity and insight. He highlights Edwards' unwavering commitment to his beliefs, while also acknowledging the tensions and debates within the larger religious and intellectual landscape of the time. Marsden's meticulous research is evident as he draws from a wide range of primary and secondary sources to provide a well-rounded and nuanced portrayal of Edwards. Ultimately, A Short Life of Jonathan Edwards offers readers a compelling glimpse into the life and mind of a man who left an indelible mark on American religious and intellectual history. Marsden's engaging narrative style and thorough exploration of Edwards' ideas make this biography accessible to both scholars and general readers alike. By examining Edwards' theology, preaching style, and personal life, Marsden reveals the multifaceted nature of this towering figure, highlighting his enduring relevance in the fields of theology, philosophy, and American intellectual history.